Kenya and Lake Turkana wind power illustrates that the dilemma between the ever-increasing demand for energy and the threat from climate change can be solved. Africa desperately needs energy and that energy must come from solar, from wind, from the renewables. Otherwise, all the energy needs of Africa will over time destroy the, uh, the world. But ironically, many of those already suffering the most from the impact of climate change are the poor with the lowest carbon footprint, like the local communities in the Lake Turkana area in Kenya. When I grew up here, this place was like paradise. There was a lot of animals and fish in the lake. There was even forest here. But now the climate is different. There's no rain and the place is desert-like, and more often we have skirmishes about water because there are more people here nowadays, says Lochilia Nyangayo, a local elder. So Africa and Kenya are faced with a serious dilemma. Population in Africa is prognosed to grow very, very fast. If Africa should be, should be fueled by fossil fuels, it would be a catastrophe for Africa and for the world. So to utilize the wind, the sun, which is all over the place here in Africa, is the future. The dilemma can be addressed with massive investments in green energy, like Lake Turkana wind power, which alone will offset well over 700,000 tonnes of carbon dioxide emissions per year. When we will start generating the power and, and delivering the power to Kenya, Kenya can claim to be 92, 93 percent of its power mix being green. That puts them in the f top four, five countries in the world on, on exploiting uh, renewable energy as their prime source of uh, power in the country. Kenya also boasts several hydro and geothermal power plants and the strong effort to promote green energy in Kenya and other African countries sends a strong signal to the rest of the world. Africa is now leading the way in many respects. The biggest focused solar pro program in the world is in Morocco. Kenya has half its energy coming from geothermal. Now we will add 20 percent uh, from wind, which makes Canada one of the most uh, uh, renewable nations uh, on planet Earth, inspiring Europe and the United States and others to do better.